guys, welcome back to The Juice. I am at my favorite furniture store, Extraordinary World, if you already know. And today on my couch, I have this beautiful lady who is a bowl of laughter. Like, you guys have already been laughing before we started rolling. Like, seriously, she's not just a comedian. She's an actor, actress. She's a singer. She's multilingual. She's, she, her hair is on fleek. Her face is beat. She's giving me life, right? Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, this is call and hand check up. Hello. Hello. Boys and girls, everybody. <laughs> Hi, Stella. I'm this is God. Check up. AKA Chubba Mara because I have parents and so let me behave myself. Hi, everyone. How are you? What's up? Can you see what I mean? Like, I'm, t I'm actually tearing up. Like, I have tears in my eyes. <laughs> Don't mess up your makeup. <laughs> Don't like mess my makeup for me. I think, I think. Okay, so first of all, before I get into this, Everybody knows you as Chino. Yeah. yeah. A lot of people find it weird when you speak like Chioma. I don't know why though. It, do you know what? It's a compliment because it just shows that you, you play the character so well mm. that people find it hard to differentiate between fake and reality. Real. Right, right. Because the first time I heard you speak, yeah. I was like, how, how did she, she... I switch And you just switch, switch away, like yeah, this. I and I thought I was good, but you are like I switch the headmistress. Oh. And I find myself doing it, all. I do it all the time. Like I, I think where, it depends on where I am at the moment. And sometimes I might be, I just had to be American today. I could be Shaquita tomorrow. And yes. I could be Sue, who's British today. And I could be Mrs. Patel, who's Indian tomorrow. And then another day. And then I can be Modinot if you want to shout. Anyone you wish I can be for you, you understand? Just think about something, you know, like they got all these nice people is doing, right? And I heard about the fact that some people just be eating raw food, like they call it the raw diet. If I can have any ideas of what they're talking about, I think raw is raw. You are not animal, you are not dog, cat, you are person. Person who cook food. This is you can take some meat, okay? This is what yeah. we're here. Like yes. we suffer from this thing. It's not a suffering. No, it's it a is very heavy market. You, let me tell you. Is this thing called mad? That's what I call it. Oh yes, okay. okay. Multiple Definitely. accent disorder. Which means we like to speak in multiple accents. There's no a definition. You know? I was looking for something to say sister or sister myself. You know? It's, it's people say it's Chris I said, no, it's not. No. It's not schizophrenia. It's, it's something more the same. It's mad. It's mad. Multiple, multiple accent, accent disorder. Oh, oh my god! Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Like, I'm gonna throw my hair with my fingers. Like, <laughs> yeah. uh, MJ, Wait, hold on, guys. Can you just? All right. First of all, let's, let's address this. You have two different color nails. Yes. So you have I, light pink, pink. And, and and purple. And purple. Yes. What's going on? Um, it's diversity. Like I just want like show that my difference is. And so like I just thought like if I like put my different colors of polish on my nails, I like it. it would like show like I was diverse. I totally and, get it. I MJ, totally get like, it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Like, what's kilo What's wrong with them? What's why? Well, okay, please. Why not? Why not? Very happy. We're just, we're just happy. It's okay like that. Just we're happy, happy with life. Yes. Great. Okay, so hey. let's get into it. Yes. The name Chico. Mm -hmm. Where did that come from? From a toaster. The honor goes to this man I met, and he was trying to toast me. And I guess he was trying to say Chi girl, like because my name my name is Chioma. So he was trying to say Chi girl, and I was like Chi girl. I was like, yeah, Western away. He said, you mean you go home by yourself like this? Oh, you're so heavenly and down. Oh, I want to come home with you. I said, bam, bam, bam. Just back. <laughs> so when, when I told my friend the next day, my friend Halima, yeah. oh, you know, sir, Tata, she now said to my, after that, she now said, every time she sees me anywhere, she would just scream, she go, oh. So when I did the first voice note I did, yeah. I introduced myself as Choma Mera, a.k.a. Seaflow, a.k.a. And I paused, she go. So that's the name that stuck. Nobody thought of any other name in that whole list. But she goes, so here we are. It fits though, because the character, you bring it out. Yes. She's she's um, she's um one of the, because I do 11 characters, and she's right. the richest one right now. So she's the one in charge. Good evening. Ladies and gentlemen. Good evening. It's your girl again. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Serpent. Okay, so you do comedy. Yes. You're a comedian. Mm -hmm. you're extremely funny. Extremely, extremely funny. So you do, you act as well. Yes. You sing. Yes. What don't you do? Mm, 
I can be an accountant because I feel mathematics terribly, so there's no need. I can be a doctor because I have too much too many books to read. I won't do that. Uh, but but that's I think I think I'm in I'm in the right place where I'm supposed to be. Did you kind of always know you were gonna be a performer, or is that what you always dreamed? I've always wanted to be a singer and an actor. Okay. The comedy thing. Like I tell people, comedy found me. I didn't find it. Yeah, I've, I've sort of like always been funny. I like doing funny things. You know, when I was younger, I was a change. You know, just always mimicking people. Like people yeah. come to the house to visit, and like at five, I'll be mimicking somebody like who either stammer or something, and mm. I'll be, you know, and and they're like, okay, and I would I would watch the, all the time. I was on TV, like watching TV, and I would cram commercials. Like I could do back to back to back. And then my my aunties would be saying, if you will just cram your mathematics like that, you will pass in class. But you are failing anyhow. But you are here cramming. You know everything on TV. Mm. But now I can pray for you. Say, look at me now. Look at me now. Hey, I'm hey. getting paper. <laughs> I love it. So you speak 110 languages. No, just five. I mean, just five. Of course, including English, but just five. Five. Aosta. Mm -hmm. Ibo. French. Yes. Spanish. Ibo. Yes. Spanish. Yeah. Pigeon. Yes. Sarcasm. Fone. Comedy. Yes. Fone. Yes. And then I have I have some introductory levels of because uh, when I, I went back to school in the US for a minute and I was studying Swahili, Italian, Fulani, Arabic. I was teaching myself Hindi because I taught myself Spanish. Um, you taught yourself? Yeah, for one year. Yeah. Can you drop a little? Because I know like. Hola, cómo estás, papi. Hola, cómo estás. Yeah, I tried. Cómo estás? Muy bien. Me llamo Chioma. Um, estoy aquí con con la niña. I don't know if you're abusing me. Like I'm just saying, I'm here with the girl. I'm like here with the girl. Uh, yeah. So I, my and my Spanish is because I lost a lot of it because I I actually learned Spanish because when I was teaching French, I taught French in high school in the US. So while I was yeah. teaching French, I had Spanish speaking students who were coming from like Mexico and they were taking English as a second language. Right. I just thought it would be nice to be able to somewhat communicate with them. Aww. on a different level and then i would go take spanish classes with my colleagues next door and my kids would be in spanish so it was it was my called my kids my students oh. would also be in spanish class so it was cute to do that and then i used the program for like an hour a day on the computer and i was just sort of like drilling vocabulary and it's it's helped a lot so my spanish is not perfect yeah. but i'm pretty conversational and and because even now i found like three people who speak spanish here in in, in nigeria oh, finally wow. So we, when I see them, we sort of like brush up a bit on it. But I, I'm really going to like intensify my uh, amelioration of uh, l'espagnol when, you know, as I go ahead. Okay, so let's get a little personal. Okay. I know like you didn't have a good relationship with your mom. Mm. How has that kind of affected you? Um, it is getting, in my opinion, I'm, I've decided to make a conscious effort to make it work between us because... I think she, my mom, I know my mom loves me. There's no doubt about it. I just feel like maybe their generation and our generation are two different, we're on two different levels of understanding right. how to deal with situations and girls and things like that. I mean, I feel like um, my mom and I are, I think we, I'm working at making sure that we are, we stay best of friends and just making a conscious effort coming out of my comfort zone. Even when I feel like I don't want to be, I would just be and just let her because I know that she means the best for me. She mm -hmm. wants the best for me. She wants me to be healthy and happy and in love and find love again and all of those things. And I realized that. And I think even at the time, I was also coming from a place of resentment. So if I couldn't yeah. see the love. As far as I'm concerned, just don't know. Everybody just stay, stay in your lane. I yeah. tell my lane. Um, my marriage broke down. Um, irretrievably so. Um, wasn't something we planned. It wasn't something that, it just kind of happened. And it's taken a while for us to get to this place. Yeah. Um, but I, I thank God for the process and for my process. And I'm better now. I'm happier. I'm not because it broke down. I'm happier yeah. now yeah. because I've come through or I'm coming through. I, I'm not where I want to be or I'm not where I should be, mm -hmm. but I'm not where I used to be. Yeah. And that's the good thing. Yeah. You know what I mean? There is progression. There is change. There is there is positivity ahead of me and so I'm looking forward to the good things in my life mm -hmm. and those are things I'm holding on to and I've chosen to hold on to so this is where so we what are. would be your kind of advice or to people that are going through similar things or um I think everyone should find an avenue to let your 
itself vent because a lot of times you hold stuff in and it's like a steam pot. Yeah. When it blows, it blows. And yeah. you don't want it to blow at the wrong time or in the wrong place yeah. with the wrong people. And sometimes you just go through something and, and people go off and you're like wondering. Um, that's because you're holding stuff in and that stuff one day has to come out. Mm -hmm. It has to. So I think everyone, no matter what you're going through, find someone you can trust. Find someone that, that will keep your secrets, that you can cry to and talk to. I had a lot of those. I thank God. I had a lot of those. And and the truth about it is my relationships remained intact in spite of that one thing falling apart. Yeah. So I'm very happy with that, um, that I still have family and friends and his family. You know, we're still very close. Okay. So I love that. I'm grateful for that. And and that's, I'm just holding on to Those are the good things that yeah. that, the, that came out of it. It's unfortunate that that happened. Yeah. But I thank God for where I am yeah. and what it's helped me get, you know. What, what it's, it's done, taught, exactly, and what it's taught me, it's so, especially what it's taught me. Yeah. So, is there any kind of hope for reconciliation or? Um. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, and I don't. I let me not say anything. It's just I don't know. <clears throat> yeah. Whatever. God is here with us. Yes. <laughs> okay, fine. I'll, I'll take that. So, is there kind of any new? Mr. Guy? Mr. Guy, Mr. Man. I just knew Mr. that Mr. Someone. Guy question was coming. No, there's no Mr. Guy right now. No? Um, Mr. Guy is Chigo. Because that's all I'm focusing on right now. I mean, I'm, I, you know, well, no, there's no Mr. Guy. I can't even say. I kind of, I, no, I can't say that there's anyone right now. I mean, because. But there's someone whispering. No. Because you smile. No, the not, smile wasn't. No, 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 no. That's, it's a smile of sheepishness. It's like there's nothing to say. You just smile like a last one of the eagles. <laughs> there's really nothing to say. You know what I'm saying is, you, it's, it's like you've met, you know, we've met people. Yeah. And people may, some people have maybe expressed interest in right. some certain things. And you now think to yourself, let me go back and think. So I'm thinking. Okay. I'm in the thinking time. Okay, so you're open to love again. It's not like you're shutting down. Eh? No, I am no. very open to love again. It shouts wide. <laughs> As wide as the world. <laughs> Just like this. Hello, love, please. Where are you? Excellent. Can you sing a little something for me, please? Let's see. Hmm. All right, can you do two things? What? One in Chigo. Okay. And one as Chioma. Okay. Nani TV. You should watch it. Uh, it will help your life. Uh, Nani TV. Uh, <laughs> Where did they find you? It's called on the spot. <laughs> okay, now Choma. Ah, hello, my love has come along. My lonely days are over. Her love is like a song. <laughs> yes, honey. You know the thing is, right? I, in my mind, I'm a singer as well. It's just sometimes oh, in, your mind? in my mind, oh, but sometimes my vocal cords don't, no, they, they, they just you. don't agree with me. Right. So they mm. kind of, you know. But it's good to be in your mind. Your in mind, my mind, yeah. So I can, yeah. as you're singing, I can mime. I can mime for the gods. You know, I can, oh. Mm. I do vibrate with the lips. Oh, you know, the church choir. Oh, and, oh, oh I will always love you. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Yes, I can do that <laughs> for, for days. <laughs> But just, you know, sometimes the sound is not correct. I know, yeah. But yeah. we're getting there. It's called shower pride. Yeah. You do it pridefully in, in the shower. Bathroom only. <laughs> Please. It's a bathroom ministry. <laughs> Don't do it outside the house. Do it where you can at least find some solace. Yeah. Your shame will catch you in your house. Mm. Um, the other day, I was listening to Adele, as you do. Mm. And then I stumbled across this um, other version <laughs> this the, it's the, it's the uncover. You know, hello. Oh, my uncover. You know, yeah. The uncover. That you did. Hello, it's me. <laughs> I'm here wondering when you pay the money that you owe. It has taken since you borrow. You said you will pay me back that time. Six months has passed and since what is wrong? What did I do? Ball. Who wrote that? You, you, you. I wrote didn't that. write it. I okay. sang it while I was in this, the booth. Oh, so you just that it's was on just the, you. a lot of Chi girl. I think Chi girl just works with on the spot. 
Because as it's in my head, I just deliver. That's why a lot of times I don't even have like backups. I'm like, can you sing it again? I don't know. Mm. Because I just sang it for the first time on stage. So I don't know. Thank you so much for coming. You're very welcome. Give us a little sign out message or something to tell your fans, everybody watching at home. Everybody, this is your girl again, Che Girl. And I'm here on the juice. I've just been juiced. Have you ever been juiced? Freshly squeezed. You should one one them. They have wrong every autumn of juice from this very old age. <laughs> they better get sweat, it. all right. Hello. <laughs> you are good. Yay. You are good. You got a good one. Thank you so you much so for coming. You are so good. It was my pleasure. You're, this is so much fun. You're, you're my inspiration. Oh, stop so that. I get it from you. I'm oh. still learning. I'm getting there. No, yeah. I'm getting better. You yeah, are there. That was there. Claim it. Yeah. See it. those things it. I know they are. I mean, you are already there. I receive it. Yes. So win the present that Chiga has brought in today. Make sure you subscribe to our channel, Indani TV, and follow us on social media, Indani TV on Twitter, Indani TV on Instagram to find out the questions. Thank you so much for You're coming. You're very welcome. My I pleasure. wish you all the best. And I'll be looking out for singles, movies. Much. Shows, I will yes, be on the lookout yes. and don't be a stranger to us. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you, you. Nani <laughs> TV. I've been juiced. She's been juiced. I've been honey. juiced. I'm squashed out. We we squeeze we are... there and we drink. All the juice is gone. This orange is dry. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, my name is Files, aka Files the Bad Guy. Well, in today's lesson, I will teach you how to subscribe to the Nani TV channel. All you have to do is click on this. So simple, straightforward.